Well, hello, hello, everyone. Welcome back. Stream. So, boy, oh boy. A couple of things. First of all, recall last time we uh, went ahead and we killed the raider guy, which locked us in having to kill all the leaders of the faction. Uh, so I guess we're going to take over New California now. Yes, indeed. But, however, it doesn't really make sense to me why New California is mad at me. I mean, all I did was, like, kill some other soldiers on a highway. But it's not like they, you know, knew about it, right? It's not like they have a way to identify me. Like... Was there someone on the radio, like, really just hollering out, like, descriptions of people who were uh, attacking them? Like, oh, so there's this guy with the, the spiky beard, and he's got, like, the spiky mohawk, and he's wearing this, like, raider-looking armor. And then there's me, it's like, uh, yeah, there's this guy who's just, like, uh, running down the hallway, uh, not the hallway, the highway uh, like a madman, killing everyone. Uh, oh my god, he's killing everyone. Oh my god, he just killed a ranger and stole their armor. Okay, maybe that would have been what happened. Like, I'd be focusing on the one guy who's doing the whole work. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair point. Fair point. Anyway. So we were uh, about to run into the NCR compound or village or Union City, I guess would be the easiest way to say it. And, um... Well, the game crashed last time, and so here we were, chilling. And uh, it was a good place to end stream, so we did it. But now we will continue our journey, and hopefully not crash again. Yeah. Let's get to it. Shall we? Ah. Launch, please. Incidentally, um, while we're waiting for the game to load, a new trailer dropped for Fallout London, which is another total conversion mod similar to this, where it takes place in London, as you might guess. But they also gave it a release year, which was 2023, so next year, like every other game that's coming out that's been announced recently. So uh, that's a thing. Ah, come on, boys and girls. So at some point in the future, we'll be able to play that. That'll be fun, right? I'm looking forward to it. It actually looks really decent since it's in the Fallout 4 engine. Alright, I got the sword. Do I have any weapon repair kits? I do not. Why am I carrying those? Pick up fruit. Okay. Eh? What? Bark, kill someone? You must have. That's funny. Good job, Bark. Killing people without me even noticing. Wait for now. Alright, since we're getting close, I'll save again so we don't have to run all that way if we do crash or something. I think I can get through that wall. Why is this destroyed, by the way? Is it because I took the raider's side? Would it not be destroyed if I did not take the raider's side? Or my guns again? Unarmed. Sword. You're Pistol. Dead. This blaster. This rifle. The, uh, this, is the, this is not the Garand. This is uh, Enfield. And we got the... Target locked. The rifle thing. Ah! Oh, there.
Die already. I'm gonna zap your ass. Ah! Yeah, it's not gonna work. This gun's too weak. What else we got? We got a shotgun. Let's go to Enfield, maybe. Gotta do much damage with this. God damn it, Kira. How'd you get in the way? Alpha, you're in the way too. Come on now, man. What are we doing here? All right. Move up all sneaky like. So we don't get like flanked and outshot. What is the... What the hell killed him? Oh, Bark got him. Are those... do not look like raider corpses. Get him! Oh, yeah. There's another one. Get him! Can't get a clear shot. Do up. I mean, that looks like a kid's body right there, right? That looks like a raider, I guess. Oh, that's a Viking. Okay, so they were raiders. I was wondering why uh, the NCR just had a bunch of hanging bodies next to them. But, I mean, it makes sense that they were... This gate for the sake of opening the gate. Go get them, Bark. And the slow motion deaths just give me sometimes. It's like they just slipped and that was it. Excuse me, Bark. Why do they all have a letter? I wonder if they're all like just the same thing but a little bit different or something. Hmm. Getting dark. Perhaps we wait until morning. Just chilling out behind enemy lines. Well, not really behind because I moved the line up, so we're on the line. But just hanging out next to cars for like 12 hours. Okay. Beautiful. So we can see all the good scenery, like NCR Trooper, you bring democracy to this land. Full propaganda. I love to see it. Oh. Ammo boxes. Is that a single 12 gauge round, really? Kind of messed up. The locker. Oh, the locker's always empty. No one have anything to store. I go in here. Inaccessible. It's just a door. I thought it was like a door into a place. I wonder if the place is abandoned because I sided with the raiders. Very well possibility. I can steal from it easily now. Gun cabinet. 
Wait, was that an SMG? Yep. Oh. Balance Drone 2 SMG. I'll take that. How's that look? Ah, love one of the guns that takes up, like, my whole screen. I don't know if there's anything in here at value. Federation of Territorial HQ. I just saw a long word that ended in L in NCR territory, so I was like, oh, it's Federation HQ. L's over there. Where are we near? The map here? Hmm. Interesting. Where was the... Where was that place at? Oh, it was over here. What, they didn't save the actual, like, name of that area? Oh. Okay, whatever. The Federation HQ, where it's probably going to be a big old fight. I'm going to get some AP back, and then we'll storm on in there. Shotgun out. Alright, let's rock. Firing. Hello, everyone. You. I want to target you. The boxers just do not care. They're just still going at it. Peasy peasy. Both the senator and the general are dead. The senator doesn't have anything on him. Yeah, those boxers just do not care, huh? Alright, general, what do you got on you, huh? Good to get uniform. <laughs> Let's see. Order from the president. Arizona Desert Ranger info. Enclave report. Snowglobe I can take? Nope. We have a active eight map mission. Can't use it. Monitors here. So there's a terminal that I can use. Anything of value on the bookshelf? That? Oh, it's just a piece of a uh, general over here. Funny. Okay, well, I guess we're hacking his terminal. All right, first try, come on, technologies. Nope. What about recuperating? Nope. Organization. Nope. There, that's fair. Okay. Well then, how about I Go through the various bugs. I would like my allowances replenished, please. Could I could I have that happen, maybe? Hmm? There we go. That's a big one. Alright. So I believe I tried an ING ending. I already tried that one. Organization wasn't it. It might be conspirators. Could be that. Not gonna be that one or that one. Could be a relationship. Yeah, there we go. 
Easy peasy. Yeah. Lemon squeezy. Got battlefield reports. Vault 18 report. Hey, I'm just trying to see if there's any uh, axe report. Legion report. Conclave report. Is this going to be like anything important? All that for nothing really, huh? Okay. How did I lose karma from that? Oh. All right, let's see. Our current quest is to explore the pass, which is, I'm guessing, over there. I can't show the location of this one off. Or is this huge area called the pass? Is that what we're talking about? Eh. All right. We also got some these orders from the president. Usual order came from President Peterson today. He wants my superiors to lead three battalions of troops to east of Vegas. When I asked the colonel why, he simply told me, control the territory. I tried to convince him that we barely have enough manpower on the land. Have controlling more cause problems. Bite my pleas, he doesn't seem to listen. Here's why the president is all of a sudden in Vegas. Sometimes I get this feeling the expansion might be his idea. There's a ranger info. Reports of large militia group supposedly enslaving nearby tribals and crucifying them. Okay. And the Enclave report. Leonidas, Enclave, Quadrant. Main body of the Enclave may have been destroyed, but remnants have been located in various places. No, blah, 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 blah. Project for the little nonsense. Okay. Well, I guess we're just going to head on out. Yep. Oh, you're just enjoying a little rest there, Kira, since we, uh, Mop the floor with all these yahoos? I don't blame you. Who's this up here? Yo, man, you talk? Like that? You need. Nothing, apparently. You like that? We're really going at it. Come on. Come on. A bunch of terminals. Citizenship terminal, patents terminal. How did I lose karma just from looking at a terminal? Come on, get out of here. Senator Deville's terminal. If this gives us anything interesting. I forget who that one guy said he wanted me to steal something from. Um. Okay. So I think it's going to be ending in M E N T. Oh, bam. Easy open. On trial. Okay. G. Okay. And the Brotherhood collapsed. Faction disappearing from the West. And again, the Brotherhood's fall never surprised me. Before the wars were inevitable. Okay. Well, how about this little this little baby suitcase? Adorable. That. Come on. Athens Tech Gold. I don't know what that was, but I'll take it. Yeah, bar. You uh, you good man? Project V thirteen. That was an interesting name. Transmission. Okay. Purification. Okay. 
Patient? I guess it would be a patient, if I had to guess. So I have six correct. Definitely got an I on N in T I O N. Maybe A T I O N would be more correct to say. Or even A T I O N. Yeah. C A T I O N. Is there another C A T I O N? Hiding somewhere? No. Okay. Let's try purification. No. All right. Let's just clear out some of the bugs. Actually, I think there's only one more patient left, right? Do I really want to gamble at all? I'm not getting this information if I fail by miraculous deep. If I were a dud, where would I be? I already got that one, huh? Okay. I guess there's only one choice. Hey, I was right. Better safe than sorry, though, you know. Fuck. Got the chase. One of my former underlings brought to my attention an ambitious plan for Vault City's cloning vats. Skip ahead a bit. Want to provide the DNA? Do you have some President Andy saliva on a napkin somewhere? The last thing we need is a copy of that old bat's brain and one of your cyborg bodies. And Councilwoman, the original owner of this DNA, must remain unnamed. Project is classified. Refer to it from this point as Project V13. Oh, Vault 13. Got it. That's why it's called V13. Blood sample will be delivered directly to you by a young ranger named Helen Tanner. It will not leave her sight during the cloning process, and you must be uh, you must return the original sample to her along with the cloned organ. All further communication will be handled in person. Interesting. A little lore about the uh, honestly propaganda analysis. This is a big empty room. They could have put like some chairs or something. At least, right? Come on. What do we got back here? Oh. Oh. Don't mind me. I'm gonna help myself to whatever's in here. What do we got? Can I open any of these? I can open this one. Bottle caps. What we got here? Some machine gun, some jet, spike knuckles. I think that's stim pack. Don't care about anything else there though. What's in this one? Some bottle caps, looks like. Okay. Who puts just alcohol in a safe? Come on. Bar. Damn. I'm hit. Come on. Alpha scared me for a second there. I thought it was like some huge assault bot coming to kick my ass. Damn. Like All right, that? well. Oh, hold on. I'm hit. Saw this firmery here. Heal myself. Remove my radiation. Thank you. God, I love those things. Whoever it was who like made those is just a friggin' genius. I'm gonna investigate or explore the past is what it said, right? We'll just explore around this area a bit more because there are a couple of unknown tags here. I don't know if it wants me to go back to the huge dam facility that we saw before or what, but wouldn't hurt to take a peek around here. El Monto Suite. But there's a map marker behind this further. In your face.
That guy really tried to come at us with a knife, huh? Mistake. Is there even much, like, past this way? Oh, I guess there's gotta be a huge area back here if there's that much of the map left. Maybe this is the past it's talking about? Pick a gander. Okay, seriously, what is the item that's, like, lowering my AP? Is it the shield? It is. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just drop that. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel faster. Like my character just feels like he's moving faster in general. Well, this looks like a pass. You like that? I don't particularly enjoy it, no. God bless these robots. I'm seeing. I didn't get to read all that because I was distracted by killing things. R9. Camera. Get NCR Trooper. NCR Trooper. There's an all 37 Viking shield here. Last ammunition. That flag looks familiar. Take a bloody note. Miscellaneous. Oops, not that one. Miscellaneous. This miscellaneous. Els Dragon sends his regards to the taxman. Urfan Miracle. Whoever his name is. Hmm. Can I not come up here? Or do anything here, I guess? Looks like not. I wonder if this is like an NCR quest. Like, eventually do or something. Seems like it would be, right? Since there's so many just dead NCR trooper bodies around. They don't seem to have anything on them, though. Yeah, the Viking shields. Huh? Okay. So this is obviously not the pass that it's talking about. Let me see our examiner. Old world photos of heathens? Is that what it said? Heathens? Okay. Hmm. There's really nothing out this way? Seems like there's so much back here yet though, right? I'll walk along here a little further. Nope, that's all just cliff face. I don't think I can climb. That structure, though, some sort of subway tunnel or something. Also, is this coal or what? Neat. At the least, railroad tracks of some kind. Can I get in here? Hmm. Okay. And towards these markers. That's back to that camp area. Nothing near around there. So let's head to this marker over here, I guess. 
I really wish the map marker for the quest worked. That'd be nice. I don't like being told to just explore. Like, okay, I'll just do that. Who's that? Oh, there's someone hostile, obviously. I got something for you. Do you? Oh, that's a rad scorpion. Ooh. Oh, I died for a second there. Shit, he's right there. There's a single friendly marker in this area. Oh, it's the bird. I don't like that birds have uh, friendly markers. I'll say it. It's just confusing. Does Scorpion have a laser rifle? Last one's in here. Easy peasy. But is there anything good in here? I don't think so. It looks like it's a normal trailer park. We should never have anything good. This map marker should be right up here. Some sort of fort. Anti-missile radar. Site A. That imply that there's a site B. Bunker there. Is that a weapon repair kit? It is. Oh, damn. Nice, a bunch of bottle caps. Not that I need them or anything. Oh, a bunch more? Why ain't that just generous? Ooh, -hoo, a minigun. It's a shame the miniguns aren't really good. Alright. There's everything there. Let's check out this bunker. Of course. Why even bother putting it there? At least I cover the door with rubble so I don't get my hopes up, you know? Okay, well. You know what? I think I'm just gonna go over here. Oh, hey. That's new. Okay. Well, this place makes a, makes a whole lot more sense now. This is, uh, which direction am I going? This way. We remember correctly. Down there is where the master is supposed to be hiding at. So we're going to be fighting our way in there, it looks like. There weren't super mutants around here before. It seems like they definitely... Uh, didn't spawn them in until now. I wish that I would be a little bit closer, though. Kills, good kills team, good job.
like a turkey shoot out here. Do they not realize I'm shooting at them from this distance? I guess there is tall grass around here and it's hard to see. Oh. Another one down. Shame this rifle doesn't have a scope on it. Another one buys the dust and... Oh, I think there might be one more left over there. I don't see any movement though. All right, now for these guys. Leveled up. Kind of cute that they're all grouping up together, like they're trying to form like a defensive circle or something. Maybe they're hearing the bullets ping off the ground or going there to like search for what's causing it. Super mutant such idiots. Hey, you leveled up. Nice. Question is what to get up higher. Since we're going in to talk to the master, I think I'll just dump everything into speech to have that. Also, let's go ahead and increase this and let's increase my perception higher because there's a lot of perception checks in this mod for whatever reason. Whoever made the mod must really like perception checks and miss them from the original games, you know? Oh, damn! That was a good bullet. Question, do I have... What's HP? Oh, hollow point, right. Dumb. Oh! That's just a rad scorpion. Losers. Now let's crush this little hill here. Look some more turkeys to shoot over here. Definitely do not want him firing that missile launcher. There we go. Easy. Another one. Oh, got his minigun. Get him, Alpha. Get him, Kira. Hell yeah, let's go. I'm pretty sure there's something. I wonder if it's even hurting him. I don't think it is. Maybe it was. Maybe it was. Never mind. Good job team, let's go. Get wrecked. What I wouldn't give to be able to drive one of those tanks. Salt Fort Dagger Point. New quest, all right. What the hell's that? How's the NCR here? I wonder if I sided with them if this would have been like the NCR coming to help. Oh, an incinerator, huh? It's a shame I can't tell Alpha to focus that guy. Okay, how about this then? Huh? Ranger Sequoia. Got 
for NCR troopers, huh? You can get a lot of experience, huh? These guys remind me of, uh... What are they called? Uh, jockeys from... Left for dead. Sorry, I got absorbed in aiming. Good job, Bark. Alpha's still good. Yeah, Alpha's right there. Doing a good boy. I think they're just gonna keep dropping off NCR troopers, so let's keep going. Is that a nightkin? Ow! That grenade hit me right in the chest! You piece of crap! It's gone. Destroy. Hey, yo, buddy, be quick. Oh my god, I can't hit this guy because his he must have right behind him when I clicked. Okay, shoot him. Fuck. Uh, friendos. Car's gonna blow up. Ouchie, mama. I don't have a doctor bag. That's too bad. I'll just do that then. Okay. Come on, team. Let's move. Uh, I think I need to go this way, actually. Now that I look. Nope, this is a dead end, too. Uh, I guess we're gonna get routed this way then. Pretty sure I can't go over this, right? Oh, I can. But I also can't. There's no real way to get past this, huh? Maybe I can go over this way. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. ammunition left, so let's get a good headshot there. Nice. Another one bites the dust. Almost out of ammo. Bark! He's come to save me! Last shot, let's go. Okay. Next, shotgun. Ah. One HP left. Holy shit. What is shooting at me? My god. What the hell? Oh my God! What is what is what is going off? Okay, I need to like get the hell out of here. Can't run with this out. I gotta go. I don't know what was shooting me, but I don't like it. Really, really long stim packs now, though. Hold that thought. Not here. Damn FUV experiments. Hmm. Free stim pack. Nice. Oh my god.
shot, Kira. Good shot. Was it that guy, the one with the missile launcher, huh? Okay. There's still someone out. Oh my god, that guy. Oh boy. There's still some with a missile launcher. There's just explosions going ever. There's a guy over there firing a. Uh... Okay, never mind. Those are just effects. Holy shit. I'm gonna save here because things are gonna get more intense after I climb up here. Ain't it? Have it not? We're good? Oh lord. One last little bit of perception here. Hell yeah. Wait. Am I special down? Why? How's perception low? Huh? Everything's lowered for some reason. What the hell? Wait, I have more ammunition for this? my stats though I wish it would tell me like what is causing my stat decrease to happen I'm not under any like effect right I'm carrying enough that my special stats shouldn't be no I'm not I'm not carrying enough hold up Lock launcher down here, I'll grab that. The minigun? I should put me over the way I need. It. Now, if I look at my stats, everything should be better, except for agility and strength for some reason. I don't know why. Am I wearing something that's lowering my agility and strength? No. I'm not. Hmm. I'm gonna pick up that grenade machine gun. Ah, crap, tastic. Okay, back with the shotgun. That guy does not want to die, oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do I have grenades for, oh my god, I do. Let's go, let's do this. Get wrecked, super mutants that are grouped up together. There's one named VV, huh? I love this gun. I just can't get the firing angle quite right, though. There's someone named Vivi. Oh, there's Vivi. Wait, is that? Save. I like how it's still going through all the crippling I've done with this. Hmm. 
I guess it opened because I had the uh, thing to open it this time. Nice, nice. Oh, it's dark and dreary down here. Hold that thought, everyone. Completion. Okay, um, mission. Hell yeah. Okay. Let us power down turret defense system. Easy. God, that would have. Oh my god, that would have sucked so much to get hit by. They really don't have any lights up in this motherfucker? There's a lot of different paths here. Does it matter where I go first? It just says explore and fight your way through. Okay. I've got a special serum ready to be delivered to the fort's air circulation system that will wipe out all mutants that come in contact with the mist. What? That includes you and mercenary Barbie. When you meet that bugbear piece of work, you give him a real sweet kick in the teeth for me. Tell him his rent is up. I'm not sure what they're talking about. I'm not even sure who this is supposed to be. What mercenary Barbie are they talking about, by the way? Are they talking about Kira? Mercenary Barbie? Uh, I doubt that. That wouldn't make sense. Hey, okay, medical supplies. Thank God. I'm gonna take all of it though. The lamp is really red. Oh yeah, the revolver on him. You can't win against my katana! Okay, is there anything else around this area? Look at the local map. Might be something over there. I'll, I'll take a look down lower. Out of the way, Bark. Come on. My light's on, right? I really wish the pip light was like more of a, a flashlight that went forward rather than like around you. What's that? Oh, it's a. I said it's a Rage and Johnny figure. Three or four? Nice. I just need one more. I don't know where the hell I would find it though. Okay, well, I think that's all the things that's there. All the mobs in this area. Let us continue on. There's still a marker there, huh? Yeah. Well. Setting that aside for now. Yes, Bark, yes, I know. Don't actually know. Just annoyed. He's gone now. <laughs> Get him! Good job, Alpha. Over this way. Hmm. No marker there, so that's fine. Yes. Is that an assault bot? Fuck. Sentry bot, whatever. Oh my giddy aunt. Yep. 
just blocks this toxic waste and not get irradiated for some reason. Damn. I like how that's just like a vault door. Cute. Vehicle tunnel, huh? I could go down there. Maybe I gotta go down there. Or maybe I don't gotta go down there. I don't know. You know what? I wanna go down there. I just wanna see what's up. Let's go. This is, uh, not what I was expecting. I'll be honest. I wonder you know, if I go up, just lock on control. It seems like one of those places where I come later, like I return here from a different path, right? I'm gonna open this trunk though, because I, I deserve to get it. Contract with Prospector HQ detonator clipboard. Care about the rest of that nonsense? What's back here though? Is there like another entrance or something? Curious. This was like a. Seems like it was a secondary way to get into the fort, maybe? Maybe if I was with the NCR or something, we could have like just blasted our way in here. But oh, that's Pip Boy. Hmm. Neat. All right, team, let's go. Back up we go through the toxic nastiness. Oh, that little place is gonna give me radiation, huh? Yeah, it is. Oh, there's a little door here. I guess we'll let Abrams is sitting right there. Okay. All right, vehicle tunnel A or B. I'm yeah, close to this one, so we're gonna go in this one. That sound. What the hell is that? Your ghouls. Hmm. Okay. These doors opening is what that was. Okay. Nothing in here though. Teammates are fighting robots down there. Is that more opening up? Well, my speech is maxed out and ready to go. I guess we'll max out guns next. Even more perception, please. Take this side, guys. I'm hurt. One ball. Hell yeah, rock. Let's go. Next side, let's go. Woo! -hoo. I'm hurt. Get him, Alpha. Get him. Yeah, boy. Uh, 
Yeah, that guy has a bazooka. They both have bazookas. Oh shit! Hello. Goodbye! Okay. I see how it is. I want to get up there, huh? Found you. Did you find me? Did you? Did you really, though? Or did I find you? I got something for you. Come here, don't run away from me. Don't run from me. An amusement massacre perk, number one. Hell yeah. Fuck on. Actually, while I have a chance here, let me just use up my, uh, Stuff that heals some health real quick, like. Why not? Alright. There we go. Yeah, heal me, baby. I know you're here. Do you? Show yourself. And they're just above me, I guess. Let's go, I think it's five? Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Just ran down and got a weapon real quick, huh? Yeah. All right, now let's take this guy out. Right there. You say you know I'm here, but do you though? Do you real? Why don't you come out? I think I have to walk past here far enough and it'll trigger them. Or not. That's fine. I'm cool with that. Oh god damn it, Bark, you moved me just the last second. Hello there. Got him. Now they opened it. Okay. We win. We win. And you won. Wants me to go down there, but I don't want to go down there yet. Oh man, look at all these shells. Oof. I thought I died for a second, and I was gonna be like, "What killed me?" Nope, it's just bark eating the knees of a uh, super muty. That looks so trapped, doesn't it? I pick these up before they explode. What do we got? 10 millis, those, those, that pop oh, that was a pistol, whatever. Heavy weapon locker. Sorry, can I not open this? That glowing green. Oh, can't get in the heavy weapons locker, boys. Let's go. Not that I really need any of the heavy weapons or anything. Why do these FEV guys, like, just show up in an explosion? Very rude. Okay, just stop. Stop, please. Thank you. Moving on. Gate to Fisher of Sorrow. Well then. 
This is not exactly what I was expecting. A fissure of sorrow to look like. Come on. Get them all? Nice. Wait, is my perception a thing that's making those things glow green now? Scanning. Scan this! Bitch. Failure detected. Nice. Uh-oh. Hold up. Before y'all get out of that plane, let me equip my grenade machine gun. win <laughs> half the problem with this is trying to find exactly what height to like aim at oh fuck I just shot Kira with one of them right in the back and injured myself because Team, let's rock and roll. I have like no more stim packs left. Drive that rocket, son of a bitch. Oh, get him, Bark. Where do you suppose this gate goes to? Oh. That's how you get down these things, huh? Okay. Do you have a point to do on this though, or? Not really. Not really, okay. It's just a waste of time. I guess if you want to get away from the action for a moment or something, you can do that. Get him! Kick his ass! Oh, Oop, okay. Now let's repair the machine and the miniguns together. was a doctor bag. That'd have been too helpful, huh? Get him, guys, get him. Right. That's enough of the minigun. What else we got? Lucky. Oh, ass on that. I some sniper rifles. May or may not come into play here, though. Let's see. Back into the vehicle storage, huh? Everyone down. That's a lot of boys. Holy crap. Okay, hold on. So 
so they're not hostile right now. Interesting. God dang. What? Excuse me? Uh, a what? Uh, yeah, uh, there's no way I'm not taking that. This is like... This is a freaking artillery piece, ain't it? Yeah, it's an 88 millimeter. No, I'm not fucking taking this. Uh, minigun, you can be dropped now. Uh, this camera, dropped. This thing, dropped. I don't need a shovel. Or these two sniper rifles. This additional one. Uh... Silence thingy, I don't need that. Extra ranger helmet, I don't need that. Drop that, drop that. I could drop the this. Oh my god. I need so much, like, room. It's gonna have to be the grenade minigun. Buy grenade minigun, buy detonator, buy C4 explosives. Um, What else can I drop? I don't think that weighs anything in my uh, aid here. Nope. What about miscellaneous stuff? Surely I got some, like, nonsense that I picked up somewhere, right? All right, I still have a guy's head in my inventory, huh? Got some duct tape. Just nine lead. I'll drop that. Metal spoon. wrench. I don't think y'all understand just how much I want to use this damn cannon. Even though I don't have any ammo for it. I'll find ammo. Trust me. That's what I do. Uh, don't use grenades ever. Okay, I need six? Six more? Parchment carbine sucks anyway. Let's drop that. Uh, lucky I'm never going to use that. Drop that. Okay, now I'm at the perfect weight. I pick up these shells? No. But why? They're what I need, aren't they? Okay, well, let's save. I'll find ammunition yet, trust me. Ah, the humans I requested have arrived. Glorious. We have been awaiting you for some time. I was worried you would run the other way when you realized this was a trap. Not that it would matter. I would have found you anyway. Hey, real quick. In the upper left corner, are those eyeballs in like a fleshy mound thing? Ah. Uh, let's see. Gotta get re ready to pump those metal bunions. I guarantee I'm quicker than you. Alpha strike, alpha set target, green giant, hostile one, execute. Ask. I am Vega, gatekeeper of the Unity. You are in the city of the Master Race, the dwelling place of the Super Mutants in their exile. City of Super Muties? Indeed. Far from the prying eyes of the meddling NCR and Brotherhood, locked away in a fortress of the old world. Few have ever dared to seek entry to this place. Any who have were sacrificed by those seeking our good graces. As you have been. I mean, you say it's far from the prying eyes of, like, the NCR, but their camp is, like, just down the road, my dude. Also, I've told the Super Mutants we defeated. Hmm. Intelligent question. I'll humor you before taking you to meet your maker. The master had a grand plan for the California wasteland. He saw a future free of human conflict. A vision of vengeance and hope. They called him a savior, 
Enlightener. In the vats of the Mariposa, thousands of our kind were born. But we were lost after the Master died. We thought he was a god, singular and perfect. But we were wrong. There was another, the glorious one we now follow. Is, uh, the one they follow gonna be the, uh, the Vault Dweller from Vault 13? All these stories from around my time. Vault Tech 2. I remember reading about the master on our Vault's terminal. Who was he? He was a man. Richard Gray. He came to Mariposa a mortal. A doctor of some kind. From a vault. Number 15, if I recall right. He took a dip in the vats by accident. Mastered the FEV by study. And rose from our meager flesh. Becoming a being of supreme power thereafter. Until he was killed by another vault dweller. The same one who took my legs. Is Vager from that game? I don't remember. It was lost as I played it. Time is a tricky thing. Life, death. With the right magics, these things have little meaning. When you finally meet the father, all will be revealed. So who's the father? Mm, you will find out soon enough. But I'll tell you this. The father, too, was a man. A man named Mark. He journeyed to the Mariposa with a group seeking the source of our supreme being. A few died fighting the machines guarding the sanctuary. Others, though strong enough to survive, came to know the glory of unity. As you soon will. What's this got to do with me? Everything. But we have spoken enough. You must come with me now. I have such sights to show you. I were to say no. Do I look like the kind of being that would give you a choice? I mean, kind of. Hmm. What's special about me? You yes. have a unique gift. An investment that the father made long ago and sowed into some far corner of the wasteland to grow in the care of others of your kind. A harvest we will soon reap. Yeah, what was the point of that? Because I'm in the wasteland to begin with. Why let me go? Are you sure you want to know of your origin? Follow me, and I will show you your destiny. Or try to fight... And we will reveal it to you after witnessing your true power. You are well armed after all, as we had foreseen. There is only so much we can do to stop one of your caliber. But I offer you immortality. Okay. Glory. Supremacy. Beyond mortal cunning. So, will you join me? Bro, all you had to say was immortality. That's all you had to say. Like, I'm in. Let's go. Let's go. Glory. I had not expected you to surrender yourself so easily. Yeah, neither did I. Let's go. Indeed. Like. Sheesh. Immortality? Yes, please. Thank you. 50 millimeter turret? God dang. That boy would be busting. But, real quick, where do we get ammunition for this giant-ass cannon? I'll follow him in a moment, but like... Giant shells? There's no way I'm not going to be able to find these, like... This ammunition, right? I gotta be able to find some. At least one, right? What's up? Don't mind me just looting some stuff around here, my dude. Hmm. Go 
don't want to fire the slug. No. Yeah, I got that. Excuse me. Pardon me. If I were this ammunition, where would I hide? More than likely in some sort of kind of container. It wouldn't make sense to just pick these things up like individually, right? Right. Oh, imagine. Imagine just like getting all those, picking them all up. They weigh zero. In the way. What's this then? A terminal. God damn it! Prophet Daniel, Fort Dagger Boy. Damn door's locked. The fallout shelter has to be on the other side too. Come on, me, just taking a peek around. Crap. I think I was supposed to go here. Ah, this is indeed glorious. The scans of your body show the Project Brazil parasite has matured wonderfully. Behold, human, your destiny. The torch of our salvation you carry within you. They never told you, did they? The vault dwellers or the Enclave. I'm sure they didn't understand it any more than you did. In the Enclave. This gift you have been given they didn't has allowed tell me you to evolve beyond the abilities of the inferior human flesh before you. But it's the capacity to survive that makes it unique. And not simply survive injuries and radiation, but your own mortality. Come, join. No! Hold up. Hold a sec. I'm going back here. I will not have my stuff taken again before I figure out what I'm doing. That seems to be the eye creature. Oh, an incinerator. Bunch of turrets. Some flamer tanks. It's failed FEV ones. Don't seem to like me very much. Another guy up there? Scientist? Little scientist? Yep, those are eyes. I knew they were eyes. Oh my god. Eh. Let me just... Eh. Okay. Save real quick. And this is some Cthulhu-esque shit, huh? Some real Eltrich nonsense. Ooh. Am I gonna start getting irradiated as I get closer? I should snag one of these suits real quick. Oh, it just increases science, not radiation resistance. Well, I'm going to take a peek. Hello there, glowing one. Hello there, burning one. Open the door to Father's Den. Huh? And that's messed up. Where, even, where did they even get that asset at? Is that really part of the uh, basic game? My quest marker is still pointing me over this way, right? 
Oh, because I'm supposed to follow Vargas, aren't I? Okay, but hold on. Hold the phone. All this shit I dropped. And you're telling me the ammunition for this gun is not here? Hold on, I saw something. Hold up. Oh, right there. Okay. I found it. Single shot. Looks like a little, uh... A wee little thingamajig. Oh, ho, ho! Look at this bad bitch! Hell yeah. Excuse you. Oh. Oh, shit. Look at this! Bro. Imagine. You see the courier walk in. With one of these motherfuckers. <laughs> Points it at you. Like, time to die, buddy. And he fires. And everyone dies. Ah! Holy crap. Oh, okay. Save that for a moment. Uh, let's put that away. All right, Vargas, let's go. Listen, I don't want you to take my stuff, okay? Please don't do that. That's very rude. And I'm tired of people taking my stuff. It's like... Very unchill of them to do that. You know what I mean? I guess if those are 50 millimeter, Yeah, it makes sense that the... I was thinking those were the 88 millimeter, but... Var Vargas. Vargas, please, just go around. That work? Nope. Hold up. Yeah, let's move you out of the way a little bit more. There you go. Okay, Vargas. You go. Maybe. Come on. Here we go. I gotta give him a little push sometimes. That's all it takes. I love this thing. I wonder how long it takes to reload. Oh, so he's just gonna take me down there. But bro, but bro, okay, let's do a quick save, like an actual save save, so I can load back to this, if they do decide to screw me over and not give me immortality, because, uh, screw that. Okay. Hey guys, uh, right here, I guess. Vargas. So, did they like knock me out and bring me here? Something? Ah, this is indeed glorious. I gotta the listen to this again, great. Show the Project Brazil parasite has matured wonderfully. Behold, human, your destiny. The torch of our salvation you carry within you. They never told you, did they? Can't be told nothing, man. Dwellers or the Enclave. I'm sure they didn't understand it any more than you did. This gift you have been given has allowed you to evolve beyond the abilities of the inferior human flesh before you. But it's the capacity to survive that makes it unique. And not simply survive injuries and radiation, but your own mortality. Come, join. Uh -huh. Go, bro. I got uh, very much like my, my gear back, though. That'd be not very nice of you. Could have removed this damn slave collar, too, while you were at it. You know, just throwing it out there, my dude. But, uh... Guess we're not gonna do that. There. I'm sure you have questions before you meet your destiny. Not that it will matter in a moment. All will be made clear the instant the transformation is complete. Ha! Ah, perception six. You put all my stuff in that airlock by the door, what for? There in the airlock can be purified of bacteria that may contaminate the vats. But you do not need those meaningless things. Those are the trappings of mortals. You will soon transcend all of that. No, no, no. I want that thing, though. Hey, 
Ask some questions before we begin. Hmm. For a mortal of lesser intellect, I'd simply force you over the edge. Well, what's Project Brazil? Hmm. A reasonable question. The scientist who created the project needed a code name to hide its true purpose from Soviet spies. They chose their primitive alphabet as the first layer, and the names of countries after that. A dumb trick, but highly successful. Most spies thought each project belonged to a nation. They never thought to look in California. Why did the scientists do this? Why else? To seek immortality. That's fair. They saw a world that would soon change beyond all reckon. But after they saw the face of immortality, Project America was meant to create the perfect super soldier. Us. Super mutants. Free from radiation. Plague. Project Brazil was meant to make men immortal. To escape all infirmity and make the old young again. Project China was intended to create plant life that could graft onto the human body and give rise to fresh oxygen and radiation scrubbers. It was brilliant. An entire ecosystem in one body. But it eventually consumed the host. Projects Denmark and France are simply more FEV stored in other places back east. We'll reclaim them in time. Cool. Well, yeah, I think I'm good. Oh. Um. Was that thing inside me? I'm sure all your life you've witnessed strangeness beyond your reckoning. The Project Brazil Parasite is the last secret from a pre-war experiment seeking eternal life. It was meant to allow a mortal like you to enjoy the benefits of being a member of the master. Sure. But it was wild. Yep. The humans saw it as chaos, twisting flesh into forms beyond their imagining. They feared it like a cancer. But it was so much more than a tool of the mortals. It was freedom from the inferior form of ma- It is immune to radiation. And it is immune from mortal comprehension. Cool, let's go. Yes. All right. <clears throat> Peace, homie. Immortality, here I come. The war for California soon reaches a fever pitch. The super mutant father's powers grow as elements of your body are integrated into the twisting organism and your fate is sealed within it. A new generation of savage beasts emerge from the depth of Fort Dagger Point, their howling forms unkillable and in endless supply. Many humans are transformed in the father's unquenchable lust for power. His army soon rises to conquer the NCR. Your final act of betrayal ushers in an era of darkness. The world is gradually conquered beneath the banner of the master race. Humanity has driven to the razor's edge of extinction for thousands of years. Eventually, a new dawn comes, but in a future far from here and unknown to the eyes of man. Oh. But like, am I conscious? Like conscious? Like, con con why does conscious feel like a like non-word right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Congratulations, you beat Fallout New Vegas. Uh, would you like to load a save prior to the Hoover Dam battle? I can only be able to turn the main menu. Yes. Okay, let's load. Uh, we'll go ahead and load this one. You know, not exactly the immortality I was seeking. So instead, let's go say hi to the father. 
and give him something to... Wait, am I out of stim packs? I might be out of stim packs. I have one left. Ooh, Nelly. Well. Jesus Christ. It scared the hell out of me when he just ran up to me like that. Open the door to Father's Den. Oh my god, this place looks... Stop where you are, human. Don't come any... Wait, what is that scent you carry? Is it really you? It cannot be. How fortuitous. My lost child has returned in our hour of need. The Slayer of the Master, the Echo of Ages. I could hardly believe my eyes. But then again... Only you could slay so many of my new generation of super mutants. Only the last one could be so superior. Ah. So that uh kind of confirms it. We are a clone of the Vault Dweller from uh the original Vault 13. Nice. Um, what are you talking about? No, but I remember your face so clearly. I released four candidates into the Wasteland tribes as infants. Only one remains. Have you ever wondered why when your friends die, you alone walk away? Why you can absorb a clip of bullets and just shrug it off? Yeah, like stim packs. No one else in this like place uses stim packs very much, my dude. Like, even I can shoot a bunch of people, and they use stim packs, and then they're healed. It's it's just stim packs, man. No, lost one. You are my creation, a mutant bred for your superior traits, a clone of the Master's Killer from Vault Thirteen. Oh. So I'm a clone of the Vault Dweller. Yes, Lost One. You are a clone of the Vault Dweller. The one who came and sundered the sacred unity so many decades ago. They walked away from the cathedral. Left it in flames. Left me for dead. But their blood was rich on the ground. So I collected it. I was only a lowly nightkin then. But the Enclave offered me a chance to rise above my station and reclaim their work at Mariposa. I took their failing second generation of mutants and rescued them here to Fort Dagger Point. That is where I discovered this place and merged my body with the FEV. I then began to experiment on the DNA I collected. I could not find the right strain in the sample I gathered, so I created four variations. You are the strongest one of them. The right one. Okay. Indeed. Has it not worked? Are you not the same as the one who killed the master? No. I left your batch among the vault exiles so they would adopt you as their own kin. That was my plan, to replicate your original upbringing. You grew up in the vault just as the first did. You were sent on a journey beyond its walls. You are the same. You share the same life, the same traits, and now you are here. I may rejoice in taking that human weakness away from you and finally restore my master's glorious plans for unity. Aw, oh, man. I had a little more charisma. Yeah, let's finish this. Indeed. But hold that thought. And let me just whip out May 8 middle no. meter cannon. That's not true. I'm not some fucking mutant experiment gone wrong. Kira, what are you talking about? Kira, you aren't. You're not a sibling of mine. Get him off me, boys. Where the hell did he go? 
Ow, my legs! Oh, stop man. That is a really light. Ouch. You know? Super stim pack. What is... What? What? Why am I walking? Did my legs, like, blow up or something? Oh, am I overweight? But how? Who did this to me? Why am I overweight now? Did I have a backpack? Didn't I have a backpack? Am I going insane? Oh, I'll do the sniper rifle. Where you at, father? Is that you over there, father? I can't tell. I don't want to shoot him just in case it's not. I think it is. Go! Well, it did a lot. Pick it up, pick it up and use it. Could you imagine if I could just pick up this turret and use it again? Hi, Father. Search, Father. Oh, I said search. Search. Father, no! Father, no! I'm over encumbered again now. Thirsty father. There we go. There your point password. Oh yeah, brother. Easy peasy. I don't know why I said confront the Enclave, though. The Reaper. Aw, oh, yeah, baby. Does this actually do, like, a decent amount of damage, though? DPS is 2,266. Oh, man. Damn. What if I just, like... <clears throat> I really want to just like spawn in some of this ammunition just so I can use this gun a lot but you know what? I'm just gonna drop the gun Wait, now. Wait, good morning. where'd it go so much, just let me oh, die. It's right well it is unfortunate I'll have to leave my baby behind it's way too much weight for like nothing did, did that skeleton just like crumble? <laughs> hey, more stim packs. Nice. I'm gonna zap Watchful eye. How happens if I shoot it? Ah! Oh, that happens. Ugh. That's Brody. Please retreat or die in a pool of your own filth. Wait. It's another alpha? Sorry, alpha. Which one's the real alpha? Oh my god, there's. There's, they, neither one is. Neither one's the real alpha. I messed up. Wait, what happened to my... What happened to my sword? Okay, I like this gun. Uh, it's very nice. Alpha, are you stuck? Easy peasy. Master Vorgoth's thoughts. Or terminal 2. Security terminal. What's this guy? Appropriate. Okay. Okay. Let's do one of these babies. And one of all these thingies here okay and now we just go this one yeah easy peasy 
Lemon squeezy. Oh. Take control of sentry bots. Yeah, boy. Enclave mutant containment protocol. Okay, well. Don't think that it worked. Whatever that protocol was. Well, I'm just blew the hell up, huh? Hello, my friend. I was gonna say hello, my friend, but I don't know where he went. I leveled up. Nice. <clears throat> more guns. More. More guns. And advanced training. Um. More perception. More perception. Strength to run with this weapon. Nice Lame. Uh oh. Huge vault door thing? Interesting. Alright, so where am I going? Place is really fleshy, huh? Is there an exit over this way or something? Or. I don't see anything. Why does it have a bladed gauntlet? Maybe it's above me, the exit is, or something? Oh, no, this is a door. Okay. Well, let us continue onward. Y'all hear my friends? Kira, you hear too? Okay. Oh, there she is. She was just hiding. Hello there, head. Beggar Point Office Desk. Project Bazil Development Note. More pharmacy supplies. To the watchful eye. Hey. You're up. You good, sweetie? This is the place. Get ready for anything. What, 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 huh? Who was this again? Was she from the vault? What happened to you? I'm a human, but with an FEV enhanced parasite in my body that makes me immune to radiation and disease. Basically, I'm a super mutant, just a little more compact. These remind me Just of uh, like you. Scourged. Didn't you listen to what the father had to say? He created you. Cloned you. When the super mutant army found this place, they studied the parasite stored here and used it to create you, a clone of their oldest enemy. So what's with the spikes? Skeletal protrusions. The Project Brazil parasite uses my body like a vehicle. Most of the time, it's happy to just heal my injuries and keep me healthy. But it has a mind of its own. I took a bit of a beating on my way in here, and now it's protecting its host. The spikes are just the first phase. The real monster will take over in a few minutes. After that, I intend on using its rampage to kill anyone stopping me. So what's your uh, your plan here? What's your story? I'll do my best. We're not so different, you and I. I was supposed to live in Vault 18 too, but I got locked out the day the bombs fell. My father and I made it as far as I-15 when we got in a car wreck. That's when the nukes hit. We walked our way to Vault 18, but... The door was already shut. We made it back down the mountain to the hospital as the fallout began to rain down. Everyone died there. Everyone but me. Was an I one of the like hunters who was at that lodge? Or should have been at that lodge? Was is that right? I don't know, I'm so confused. You've grown up in the shadows of events set in motion long before you were born. Weird corporations and military experiments 
Nuclear wars and politics. Some gross meat machine made you its trump card in a game you only just became aware of. It happened to me too. I was a senator's daughter. You probably remember his statue in the atrium of Vault 18. That was my father. Senator Andrew Aran. His friends called him Skulls. Mm -hmm. Okay. He had an experimental program with the Enclave meant to make people immune to radiation and disease. Project Brazil. It was their plan B. In case the vaults didn't work out, they wanted a generation of people immune to the new plague and fallout. The super mutants were bulky and sterile. We were meant to be something different. Instead of transforming our whole bodies, they just wanted one unique organ. But it wasn't complete. The war was coming. The Enclave panicked, and so did my father. So, I was implanted early. Before they worked out all the bugs. Out of bugs? The parasite. It doesn't just clone damaged tissue. It replicates your whole body. The early models made a beast like the father. And the master before him. It was a kind of cancer. The one I have almost worked as expected, except that every now and again, its desire to reproduce kicks in. It turns my body into a monster. The bone blades are first, then the super mutant form kicks in. The beast eats anything it can get its claws on, then uses that protein to make its clone. After that, the clone rips its way out of my guts. It has all my thoughts and memories, my face, my attitude, and then it runs off, thinking that it's me. I just stepped in green goo too, that's not gonna happen to me, is it? Not exactly. I'm not sure what the father did to you. You may not go through the same transformation I do. He wanted to dip you in the vats. I don't know if you noticed while you were busy shooting them, but the mutants have a kind of cult. They worship the FEV. They dip everything in it. You know, I just gotta say, she looks kinda death claw ish, right? From like the little hand claws to the scaly skin. Is she gonna turn into a death claw? Is that what this is? How many of these weird bounty hunter clones are out there? You've already met them all. Bragg and Chevy are my last clones. What? But Bragg is a dude. Not always. He was me once, until they tortured him, turned his mind against itself, and wrapped it up in a cult of shame and fear. They kept him locked away in a cell on the Poseidon oil rig for a decade, trying to turn him into the best soldier he could be. Eventually, they broke him, I guess. He boxed away my voice in his head and all my memories, made up a character to live inside. He's pretending. The propaganda and military jargon, it's just another role he plays. Sure. It's why they made him an infiltration expert. Yeah, but he's dead. He's lying. He's been lying his whole life. It's all he is now. The lie and its consequences. He'll kill his way around the globe until there's no one left to call him on it. Unless you and I put a stop to it. Well, I already killed him. Didn't I? Did I not? Did I not kill Bragg in the, uh, the vault? Why, why am I even asking this? He was, like, against us, right? Some, I'm sure. But not all of them. He can tell the truth from a lie. He just chooses to keep what matters m sure. Alright, let's go. Thank you. Lead them on until the last minute. Then, attack. The nuclear missile they're preparing to launch will destroy their bodies down to the cellular level. We have to get them positioned beneath it. Then, this will be over. No more resurrections, no more clones. You can be the last of our kind and walk away. I have to go get ready. I can't hold off my transformation much longer. I'll meet you. Yep. Cool. I have no idea what the fuck's going on right now. Like she's some sort of weird, like, super mutant death claw-like thing. I'm a clone. Apparently, Rags or whoever is still alive? Question mark? And, uh... Yeah.
I said she'd meet me upstairs, but she's still just standing here. Boop. Hell's this guy? Jerry Oran? I feel like I killed you too. I feel like I killed all the Orans who are still alive in the vault, huh? Did I not? Wait, look your laptop. That didn't do jack shit, did it? Hello there. Don't mind me, I guess. I'm gonna walk through all this nonsense. What is this maze-like place? Are you messing with me right now? Okay, let's put away the minigun for a moment. If I can just run through here real quick. Not that way. I'm just like, eh, nope. Can I go through here? You're gonna have to make a maze. Ooh, stuff. But I can't open. Free. How about this stuff? Can I open this stuff? Who the? Fuck? Stop right there, vault dweller. You got the I've glowy eye too. I've been preparing for your arrival since you left us for dead in that crumbling vault. I have to say, I'm impressed. When I met you, I would have never taken you for one of us. But after all you've done, it makes sense. You've carved a swath of destruction across California. You've done things even the Enclave thought was impossible. But now, it comes down to you and me. You'll be the one left to burn this time. Why aren't you dead? How the hell did you do it, Chevy? You're head vault security, one of us. The Colonel and I were never vault. Yeah, I mean, we know Wasting this already. Scout stole Project Brazil's mutant container. They also had healthy adults and children to recruit for the Enclave's genetic purity program. Now there's nothing left. Man. Project Brazil crap. How is it worth the lives of 300 people? You are Project Brazil. Or what's left of it. You're a product of the same virus that keeps John. Okay. That's what this fortress was built to contain. Or destroy it in case the experiment escaped well. They weren't expecting super mutants from another base to break in and steal it after the Great War. Or that they'd... Okay. We are the harbingers of a new era. One free of the wild mutations that have corrupted this land. When we are done, this world... Yo, girl, is that a fucking plasma gatling gun? Yo! Get her! Get her while she's down! Do it! Yo! Well, that gun though! Come on! Bro, that looks fucking cool! <laughs> it's mine now. That is mine. What's better? Aw, oh, man. This one is so much better. Well, the Plasma Gatling is so much cooler. Which is why I'm using it. Let's rock. So I can't run with it out though. <laughs> I wonder if I would have had charisma, could I have like gone in here with her and been like, we're friends or something like that. I don't know. I'm not a fan of the noise that this makes though. It's a very Bad noise. But look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look, look, look at it. Look, look at how it looks. Oh my god. That was like I just had a stroke or something. Alright, what we got here? 
Ooh, an anti-material. Ooh, stim packs. Thank you. I need those. I don't know what that does. I'm going to tap it anyway. I will take the anti-material rifle. Fires 8 strength. I think I'll have 6, right? Also, I need to uh, re-equip my stim packs there. Rock. Oh, rookie here. If it isn't Dude. the little upstart from Vault 18. I just turned the corner. I've been looking forward to a second showdown with you. You killed 30 of my patriots. Their blood is on your hands. I bet you feel real proud traipsing across the wasteland. But your game is up. Now I have the home court advantage. Dude, why do you love football references so much? Calm it down. Seriously, how do I kill you? <laughs> What didn't your pappy downstairs tell you? <laughs> You're just a Xerox of some dead guy he scraped off the kitchen floor. Your Project Brazil, the little parasite that could. You have the same experimental virus in your gut squirming around that we do. He installed one of the Enclave's top secret properties in you, and now the whole world is after your corpse. Nerd superstar. Bullshit. Something like that's impossible with pre-war technology. Impossible? <laughs> like you ain't? An out-of-shape little nerd that can't even handle a vault ball turns into Captain Cosmos in a week? I've seen your handiwork scattered all over the wasteland. You have a death toll that'd make any general proud. Too bad you were born on the wrong side of some mutant line of genetic code. You'd make a fine weapon. Unfortunately for you... That line just ran out at the receiving end of my rifle. You know what? Alpha, sick him! Oh, that's real good, kid. <laughs> you and your toy robot's gonna take on a veteran enclave officer in one-on-one -on -one combat. More like five-on-one, -on -one, but... Okay. Alpha, get him. Oh, shit. Oh! So that's what Alpha does if I tell him to kill people. Nice. Well, Alpha, well, well, well. I guess, uh... You really come in handy, don't you? Good boy! Man, I could have just, like, killed that Vargas guy, too. I know his name wasn't Vargas, who wasn't going to know, right? But... It's whatever. Do I need to activate this, or...? My current objective, I should look at it. Beat John and Chevy. Get them both down at the same time. Front the Enclave and explode the pass. Okay, well, I think he's not getting back up. So there's two markers there. One over that way. Did she get back up? She did. Okay, I don't think she's gonna get back up from that. Like, there's no way she recovers from that, right? Absolutely no fucking way, right? Sir, you're a pile of ash. Should be. I'm gonna hit this. Probably running self diagnostics. You have to drag Chevy's body under the jets of the missile up ahead. Hurry, before she resurrects. What? What do I gotta fucking do? How do I drag? Hey, there's no way. There is no way I'm gonna be able to drag her body. Which piece? What piece is her? This piece here? Is that her body? Clearly not. Oh, this piece. Can I drag this piece easier? Dude, what the fuck do they mean? What do they mean I gotta do? Well, that doesn't count. Did I, like, fuck this up? Who designs this?
Um, Alpha, what happened to your legs? What's she saying? You have to drag Chevy's body under the jets of the missile up ahead. Hurry, before she resurrects. I'll just let it resurrect, then I can just, like, move her over here. And she's saying I need to drag it all the way down here or something? Surely not. Surely I don't have to drag it all the way down here. Fuck! Whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Ugh, I, I, I couldn't hit the white control quickly enough. Well, maybe she'll still be alive and I can... Okay, perfect. Oh, rookie here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Alpha, get him. Okay, perfect. Where you at? You can just fucking hide from me, huh? Yeah. Super stim pack. Let's not use this gun, because if I use that gun, it's gonna tear them apart. Actually, I think all of my guns would tear them apart. So I guess we're gonna have to use the infield. So, oh, I just have to click on her body. You managed to jump them into the missile silo. Never defeat okay. her. Bye. Okay, we have one last thing to take care of. Get the missile ready. When the engines ignite, it'll vaporize Bragg and Chevy, and my mission is over. It's Attack 5 Merv. It has five warheads inside, one for each FEV storage facility across America. Including this one. Project Brazil will be dead. For good. And so will all the others. There's one more on... Enclave base? Time for one last pre-war history lesson, kid. Project Brazil is just the number two facility where FEV was stored. Project America was Mariposa military base, which was nuked to high hell. Project China, Project Denmark, and Project England are in the Midwest, Chicago, and Washington, D.C. We get this missile airborne, Bragg and Chevy will be vaporized, then this nightmare is over. For me, at least. I'm going to go down there and make sure they can't distract you again. You stay here and trigger the launch protocol. Alright, cool. I won't be able to hold them off for long. Make sure you target the Enclave bases. They're marked on the map. You know you're not coming back up after this launches, right? I made my pee. Cool. Bye bye. I'll make sure they're under the jets when this thing. I'm good with that. I guess in a way I did get the mortality that I wanted. Okay. This a control system. Why would I target the NCR military bases? Countdown has been invoked. Into a safe distance away from the missile silo. Incidentally, isn't the uh, missile going to rain down on this base? So isn't it like not safe? Regardless? Woo! We win! Oh. Don't need to like haul ass because there's a nuke?
all this. No voiceover. That's the basement we were just in, right? That's the father's lair. That's such a cool designed wall, by the way. Like, take away the guts and gore. Just pretty pog. Incidentally, if he could revive from literal ash, how is the jets of a nuclear missile supposed to, like, actually do much differently? You know what I mean? What are all these images? Like, the voiceover would be nice. What is this supposed to be? I feel like there's supposed to be a voiceover, but like it just is not working for some reason. Because this is like the same ending that we got, right? Before? For the most part. Like, it showed us some things. Mm -hmm. Cool. I suppose. Yes. Okay. Well, that was that. There's just one more thing that we want to check out here. The Father's Den, Father's Den. We got we gotta go way back, I think. Um That's the pass. Oh, let's go. We are after this. Was it? I think it was here. This is the one I want to reload. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So here I am. Way, way back. And I have the choice of going left or right. Remember? And before we went up north and got ambushed by these stupid frickin' losers uh, at, you know, the raider camp. This time, let's go to NCR path. And see if anything changes too drastically, shall we? Actually, what weapons do I have right now? I think I have like nothing, right? Yeah, I got like nothing decent. This laser rifle might be my best gun. There you are. Now you die. Damn. I'm missing. At least all my friends are here, except for Ben. I don't care about Ben, but Alpha and Bark are still here. Came about Kira though. I'll have to look out for a group of raiders. If uh, a group of raider comes after me, I'll just have to console command kill them all. Because last time I just got hit by like a single stun grenade, and it locked me into the raider path. We just avoid that. We can avoid Let's getting the rear ending. I got him only level eight. I'm such a, a little baby. Still going this way. Is that a gecko? This is the first time I've seen a gecko in this game. Holy crap. 
I've seen like gecko hide before, but never a gecko gecko. Ow. This is a really like blue lake, by the way. Usually the water's all like dirty and nasty and shit. Surprised. Charge at me, motherfucker. Okay, Alpha got him. Never mind. So here's the plan. I don't mind doing the NCR route. If they don't steal my stuff. Okay. If it's one of those, oh, we're going to take all your gear and force you to work for us like a slave collar around your neck kind of things like the raiders did i'm just gonna end at that point oh my god i can't hit it alpha shoot it for me okay i got it god how far am i going here i'm getting there just a little surely Miss, 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 miss. Aha! Point blank is all it took to kill it. Nope. Let's weapon three. This one? Okay. This might be a little bit better. Don't have the strength to run with it. A rattler? Yep, right there. Okay. Is well, we're getting closer. A little bit surely. Reach there in no time, lads. <laughs> Go. Hmm. So as I thought, the uh, bridge where that Raider versus NCR battle took place is where I'm going to be at, huh? God damn. The arc is... It wouldn't work. Arc is like lethal once he gets close range. Thank God for the path of the scientist. You there! Hold your position! What are you doing here? It's uh, very convenient that she has a speaker system set up there, huh? Do you need help? Vault Dweller, are you aware that you've just stepped onto a live battlefield? Ah, man. What's going on? Who are you? I'm Terry Vargas, Desert Rangers, Delta Company. My team and I were heading south along the 15. Those raiders ambushed us north of here. I met up with an NCR caravan, and we've been pinned down for over an hour. There's a second unit heading north that just got hit. You don't look like much, but I could use an extra gun to help me reach the captain. You game? I can buy support, but I'm not a fighter. Let's try this. I can help these people, but I need you to help me. We're screwed if we don't repel their attack. Our only hope is to take out this bridge and book it for Union City up the 138. If we don't, we won't live to save anyone. Come talk to me when you're squared away. We'll try to find you another job when you hit the highway. Quest added, bridge over I-15. Defend her position. Okay. You say a uh, dead NCR trooper? It is. 
my current like armor again? It is. Twelve. Okay, so mine's better. <laughs> Got him. Damn raiders. Hey, Ben. Hey, are you ready to save that NCR captain? Oh, um, let's see. What's the plan? We need to take the heat off the NCR troopers. Do anything we can to buy them time. If you help hold the line, that'll be enough. I'll take out the mortars and the guy in charge. After that, we bug out, run to Union City. Okay. I can't ask any more of you than to put your life on the line. If you survive this, I'll make you... A Oh yeah. Let's do it. Right. Follow me. Stick to cover and avoid the open desert. They're dropping mortars all across our path. Take the long journey to Union City. Man. The entire playthrough up until I restarted. I was wearing her armor. I hope I can find another set of it. If not, he's looking like a prime target. This isn't a battle we can win. We should just the captain make a straight dash for Union City. Come on. Ben, shut up. You're gonna betray me anyway. Here, I'm a loser. Bombs are flying, people are dying. That's okay. Because it's not me. Oh. Get down, get down. Your range of Argus. Yo, I mean I'm just looting your ammunition, sir. Every little bit counts. Every little bit counts. Cowboy repeater. I don't like it. Yes, sir. I won't ask. I'm just glad to see a friend of face. Take out the commander on the bridge. You think that's a good idea? It might just piss him off. It's my dick. I'm shoving it to the hornet's nest here, Ranger. After he's down, we can get out of here. You're thinking we head to Union City, repo there, and sort out a plan of action? Affirmative. Can't go anywhere until that CO is dead. Let's see if the kid can handle themselves. Then book it back up to the 138. You heard him, kid. Let's run up the line to take out the CO. Move up! Move up! Patriot missile security handprint item. Hey, artillery officer, can I, like, have you launch a fucking missile for me? Apparently not. Okay. You Marcus, you coming? Let's run up that line and take out that CO. What the hell? I think I want to go to that tower. For some reason, I'm just like being called to it. Glory officer is dead here. Put an LMG, I'll take that. See anything here? Remote console controls. Ooh. Fitting engineer laptop. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Fire the missile. Missile not armed. What? How do I arm the missile? Gotta go back there and arm it or something? 
Man, whatever. Just take him out, boys. Here we go. This guy just hissing me. Yeah, the uh. No, I'm dead! Fuck. I, I don't have enough health. Or armor, I guess. I'm just a wee little boy. Damn. Let's run up that line and take out that CO. Question is, is there a way to arm this missile from the side before I go up there? Oh fuck. Kill driver just took a fucking dive and dead for the What? Did I just say it required a Require seventy five oh my god. What do I have? Surely it's Why is my special reduced? I'm not carrying enough weight. I'm not carrying enough weight. Hold on. Need a little more. Excuse me. Excuse me. There, that's enough. Now I can hack it. Damn. Okay. <clears throat> Let's try surrounding. Oh my god! Love it when I get it on the first try. Alright. Arm the Patriot missile. Select missile target. Um. Check the uplink. Annual override installed. Fire via tower. Malfunction. Okay. Easy. Let's go. I. And actually do something now. I'm gonna destroy this bunker with my missile. So I guess the uh the beam pointing to the bunker was showing where it would hit. Okay. So I'm the artillery officer, I'm just borrowing some stuff from you. Good on you, mate. Alright. Put this baby up. Hold tight, y'all. We got this. Oh. Fire the missile. Y'all gonna die! Tink! Ugh. Easy as that. Destroy the artillery targeting computer. Completed. All back to Captain James. But first, get some experience since I am quite in need of it at this point. I can also use some ammunition too, so that's always uh, very nice. Jump, kill them all. Can't pick that lock, huh? I guess this is before I level up my security all the way. Let me, uh, 
do some stuff quick. Whipped and silent. There's a garment rifle. Yeah, get rid of that. There we go. Your blood will soak the earth. All right. Let's go check out that bunker. Yeehaw! Maybe. Can I even uh, get in there now that it's like completely destroyed like this? Can. And there's ammunition to be found. Psycho Raider. Will the fire hurt me? Nope. Aha! Jonathan Noss. Noss energy cell? Noss's gun. Raider. Badass armor. Boss armor, I guess. Wow, the value of it is just awful, too. How worthless. Well, I got a, uh, a rare gun. Noss's gun. That does... Basically no damage. I think it just looks like a plasma defender, too. Yep. Very generic, but I'll take it. All right, guys, let's get back to the base. And we will uh, take down anyone that gets in our way. Let's just drop down here. That's right, you hiss at me. I don't give a fuck. Don't run away. Oh my god. Stop running! Ha! Swear. Be a good place to pick up stim packs, I guess. I don't know why everyone who died happened to have a stim pack on them. Seems weird if they died with a stim pack, right? Dear Joe, I do all the uh, NCR troopers have notes on them like this? Come on, troopers, let's get back to safety. Also, crack around, hold on. One moment. Ooh, that has a lot of rounds on it, don't it? Hunting rifle too. Cool. Back to the captain. All right, the raider commander is down. Pull back. Pull back. Repo on the on ramp. Let's go. Move. Let's go, everyone. Charge. Are we going this way? Isn't Union City back that way? Maybe not. I'm a little lost. I mean, all the raiders are dead. I don't know why we are necessarily retreating, but Shots for this gun? Damn. <laughs> that guy did not stand a single chance at all. Like, he just flat out got destroyed. Why are you running off the road like that, Captain? Huh? Get him, boys. I don't know if I'm getting experience for that, though. God dang.
Those guns are gonna be out of ammo by the time we uh, impact the Union City. Ooh, shiny lights. Man, if I was in the wasteland, all someone would have to do is like the shiny lights on a building, like trap me into going to it. Because I would 100% do that. And I would just die in the shot. Cockroaches! I will proceed to follow them after I search this place. I don't think there's going to be anything useful, but you never know, you know. There's a safe back there. Can I get to it? No. Can I get, get it through here? No. That's a shame. Okay, well, anyway, moving on. <laughs> Wait for me! I'm coming too! Man, they left me in the dust. They did not even, like, hesitate to just be like, screw this guy. Saved our bacon, but never mind. Also, we're just abandoning that missile launcher back there, guys. It's like, I'm not even sure how they transported it there in the first place, but good on them. Well, this looks like Union City. What is that? Yo, your peace. Okay. Bestowed. Walter! Hell, am I ever glad to see your ugly mug? Captain Jameson? What the hell happened? Who are these guys? Walt, you wouldn't believe me if I swore on my mama's grave. Get that gate open. Yes, sir, Captain. We'll grab a beer later. You can swear me in, I guess. Hey, what about this weird-looking kid? Bear with me. Come on. This armor looks so much better than, like, anything else. Where's a shiny sign. No, it crashed. <gasps> Think. We'll give, we'll give it a moment. Maybe it'll come back. Pray. I don't think it's coming back. I think it's dead. It is dead. Well, let's start it back up real quick. At least I could finish that quest and figure out if I lose my stuff or not. I hope we're not going to have to run a bunch more. I guess my computer just does not really like that area of uh, the game because I think it crashed both times right there look over right here bear with me come on Ooh. I didn't see our headquarters is all the way over there right so I could just like avoid that little like area Remember correctly when I like survived, well not survived, but like I did not freeze up. I went around a bunch over here, right? Then I went over here and around this way. Looked at that and I was like, meh. Over there and I was like, meh. Then I went over here and I saw that Molly's place over there. Let's relink up with them here. Yeah. Maybe I just don't like Main Street or something. I don't know. 
Quick save. Why are all the NCR troopers like coming this way? I feel like some of them just go about their business. I can understand the ranger and the captain. Rest. Out of memory? What do you mean out of memory? What's out of memory? Not my computer, I can tell you that much right now. I don't know how the game managed to get out of memory just from running up that far. I have like, I forget if it's 32 or 64 gigs of RAM in my computer. So it's like impossible for me to run out of memory. So let's just try this again. Jameson, good mate. Once more with feeling, you know. I don't trust this silver. Beware of treachery, my friend. I don't care. We need to see this general ASAP and leave the kid. He's with me. Captain Jameson, what the hell are you doing in my office? Can't you see we're having a meeting? Sirs, I apologize for the intrusion. This is Carrie Vargas of the Desert Rangers. Well met, Ranger. What's this about, Captain? Sirs, I regret to inform you that our convoy was ambushed by raiders at the I-15 Beltway. What? What happened, Captain? Details! Able Company was ambushed minutes before we were. We got the radio transmission and double-timed it to their position. My unit, Baker Company, followed them in. We were pinned down until Ranger Vargas and his vault dweller intervened. We eliminated a survivalist commander and immediately ran to Union City. I'm sorry, sir, but Able Company was lost. You mean to tell me that a band of raiders successfully ambushed 80 men? 80? Sir, the raiders were in force and were assisted by aircraft. They had vertebrates bearing enclave marks. Captain, do you understand the gravity of your claim? Are you certain? Yes, sir. Ranger Vargas can confirm. Yes, sir. I can. The survivalists appear to possess enclave technology. They overwhelmed my unit with plasma weapons 10 minutes earlier. General, if what they're saying is true, we can face an imminent enclave threat. Gentlemen, the contents of this conversation are classified. Everyone leave this room except the kid. General, I have to object. Get out! All of you, now! Sir, I will have to inform the Joint Chiefs of this. Vault Dweller, come here and take a seat. I'd like a word with you. Staff Why? Sergeant, close the door. Why am I the only one? He's getting singled out. Well then, I'm very pleased to meet you, Vault Dweller. My name is General Silverman, head of NCR forces in this territory. If my subordinate is correct, you may have unwittingly fallen into possession of top secret NCR intelligence. Am I correct in having understood that your vault was captured by Enclave forces? Uh, not captured, sir. It was fucking destroyed. They cannot capture it. I do always a vault dweller, I say, wearing full vault dweller uh, security armor. Sorry to hear that. I assume the explosion reported in the mountains was Vault 18. I'm sorry for your loss. I'd be lying to you if I said it didn't shock me. The Enclave has been gone for years, crushed by a decades-long war. Vault 18's been off the radar, too. Can you tell me exactly what these Enclave are looking for in the vault? Where did they get your location? They were led by a Colonel John Bragg. It seems they were out to capture us. Um, We funneled the Enclave into a crossfire and Bragg was killed and then our reactor blew. That's it. Nah, our waste down scout took them in years ago. They eventually turned out against us. Mm. They were led by our Colonel Bragg and they were out to capture us. Apparently. Never heard of him. Like I said, they've been gone 20 years. They must have a base out east, low on manpower. I'm going to venture a guess that by us, you mean healthy adult humans. That sounds like their MO. I don't know if you're aware, but they've pulled this old stunt before. You're just the latest. So, how'd they get in? Always done scouts, let them in years ago, and eventually turned on us. Hmm. 
Wasteland Scouts. No doubt old Doc Kevin Rossman. I always expected his vault to be up there somewhere. You do know that Rossman is wanted for treason in the NCR. And by helping him, you're also implicated. Yeah, can we just go back to talking about how the Enclave screwed us? Right. Now the questions I want answered. What happened to those Enclave agents? Oh, they funneled the Enclave. Oh my god, I'm going through everything. Yeah, we, we funneled them, Bragg was killed, and the reactors blew. Hmm. You must be a highly competent soldier to pull off a counterattack like that. You walked across Raider Alliance country, killed a psychotic commander, and before that, you defeated veteran Enclave officers in battle. I mean, I wasn't I'm alone. starting to get a picture of you as quite an asset. What do you say we have a talk about continued service in the NCR? Sir, I don't know if you realize this, but I just walked in here with like a robot dog and a giant robot like killing machine. Those are the things that helped me out, sir. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What about my people? I can't promise you much, but I'll have it taken care of. You people have been through quite a lot in the past few days. You're free to rest here. A man named Marius lives north of here. He'll be glad to let you stay with him until more permanent accommodations are available. Cool. So, uh, need service? Not quite. You see, I've needed someone in your position for a long time. Someone outside my chain of command. Someone not NCR. Who doesn't follow rules? The New California Republic is in a tough position. We're facing a civil war between the powerful Shebanks, the mob, and Congress is deadlocked. My country's army is tied up in bureaucratic bullshit that's staying my hand. It's getting good men killed while the hub's politicians get fatter. I'm afraid these survivalist raiders are a true and serious threat to our nation's security. Congress doesn't agree. They just want to sit on it. If even a fraction of the reports from Arizona are true, there is an army on the horizon big enough to bog us down in war for decades. I'm not just saying that the Raiders are a problem because Union City is my hometown. I'm saying they might get us all killed if not dealt with. With this news that they are in bed with the Enclave, I just can't risk it. I need people like you to go above military order and stop them. There's no way I can trust Congress or my superiors with this. It has to be you. And for it, I guarantee you will be taken care of. What do I got to do? That's a good question. What I'm going to leave up to you. Give me a day to sit on it. I've got some questions to ask and a serious situation to ascertain. I'll have your answer tomorrow. In the meantime, feel free to sit back in town. Grab a drink on me. I bet you ain't got any cash. Here's 20 bucks. Spend it smart. Why do I feel so short? I'll let you know when I've reached a decision. Head on out the door and wait. Ah. Uh, so we. What the fuck just happened? I just leveled up and then uh, there was an explosion. Well, shit. I'm gonna oh, just increase my lock picking. And then, uh... <clears throat> Let's get charged. What the shit is going on out there? You better get out there and help Jameson get a grip on what's happening. Staff Sergeant, open this door. I want to report on what those raiders are up to ASAP. How's that having a good old hell of a time? Come on, kid. The day's Go. not over yet. We're just getting started. Protect the main gate. Good God. My God. The game wasn't responding for a second. Holy shit. I was getting a little bit, uh, concerned. God damn! 
Don't mind me and CR Troopers just taking your ammo. I feel like I'll need it. Y'all good in here? He's good. Undelivered note. Out of the way! Bark. Come on. She bad, huh? Assist the NCR in repelling the attack. Actually, I got a better weapon for this. I think I have a minigun. Lightly armored targets in a target-rich environment? Yes, please. Is that just a slave? Yeah, just a raider slave, huh? Yep. Out of ammo. I just want to switch guns, please. Alright. That's right, get out of here. Lucky I don't destroy your asses. Well, oh. here's mine. Now we return to the general again. So let's do a quick save again. I'm probably gonna have to take this light machine gun. Thank you. All right. And before it crashes again, when I blow up this street. Oh, I'm safe so far. Town seems to have a lot of crashing problems, though. A bit concerning. Man, like... A dozen or two NCR just died from that one little attack. I think they can crash again. Yep, it's not responding. Okay. Once more into the breach, good friends. I think if it crashes again, we might just call it and uh, end the series here. Especially if it crashes again in the stream. It's not responding to the loading screen. Oh, there we go. Maybe? Okay. We're good. It's lagging a little bit, though. Hmm. Yeah, this town does not like this game. Or is it the game that doesn't like this town? All right, let's do a quick save before I enter here. Just so I uh, don't have to reload again, perhaps. Okay, I got in no problem this time. General. Ah, there you are. You've turned into quite a sound investment already. Good work. We're going to be sifting through the ashes of that fight for weeks. NCR radio's already got wind of it and are having a field day. It sounds like we're going to have to advance our deal here. I just lost water and power in Union City in the last 30 minutes. We ain't got enough boots on the ground to go scout it out and see what happened. I have two missions for you, if you're willing. Over the terms of our agreement, I don't care. Deal with what we're doing. Let's go. All right. 
Now that we've got all this pleasant talk out of the way, we better get hurrying. Union City is without power and water. We've had electricity from up north of New Reno, nigh on to 25 years. There's an old relay station on the dry lake routing the juice to us. There's a savage chieftain out east. As a tribe, stationed around a water reserve from before the Great War. It's where we get our pipeline. Raiders must have hit it pretty hard. The scouts say they're fending off some locals. Those same locals are in control of our water supply. I need you to get the power running at the relay, then hightail it over to the savages' hidden city to fix the water. Awful lot of footwork, General. It is, but you'll be agile working alone, operating on your own rules. But It'll take about eight days for NCR to finally rally its forces together and take a defensive line against the Raiders. Water yeah. and power are critical to our survival, but all my men are trapped here, holding this position. Yep. Yeah. Is the power plant issue? Unless the Raiders genuinely fucked it up, it's just a matter of throwing a switch. We replaced all the electrics 20 years ago. This line doesn't feed all of L.A., just part. So NCR isn't freaking out about it yet. Hell, if anything, it's buying them time to hit the crime lords. Power's not a giant concern. We've been in the dark before. But it's nice to have cool drinks and fresh food. So you'd better hurry. What if I can rig up an alternate power source out here? Map has to relay. Well, judging by your vault pass, that's not impossible. I'd say you go check up with old Marius in his base. Just take the road up on north into the fields. It's got this weird cloaking device on it. Turns invisible until you're right on top of it. Marius is pretty crazy. Better get yourself ready. Hey. What about the water? I drew up this map during the battle. Here, I'll show you where to go. It's a long, dangerous walk. Zybula is a California savage town out in the hills. There's a canyon they're holed up in where the dunes meet the foothills. They call it the Hidden City, and it's just that. Hard as hell to find. But there is an underground water line runs here to there. The savages turned off the ancient water pump, or it just broke. You'll either have to repair it or find an alternate plan of attack. I think I can repair it, but what are the alternatives? You could carry it all back on foot, but I imagine that'll make your back a little sore. I'd say you can handle it. That vault tech engineering is about the same as this whole deal. There's a dank old vault out there. Really small, though. All it had was a supply of water. Wonder what in the hell they were thinking. I better be going. All right. Just make sure to keep an open mind. There are a lot of ways to solve these problems. Not all of them require you to get shot up. All right, I'm going to go. I like your enthusiasm. Before you run out and conquer the world. Science always triumphs. All right, then. I'll see you. I don't know why he called me gunslinger when I said I'm going to solve things by science. Okay. Speak to Senator DeVille before I leave. Oh, he's not voiced. Oh, You're God. The vault dweller that has the general up in arms. I need to speak with you. Please have a seat. God. That sounds pretty pretentious. Okay, sir. So, General Silverman has sent you on an important mission. I have an addition to that. If you're willing to listen to my proposition, I could make the venture quite profitable. If not, things could get very difficult for you. Okay, a typical, uh... Corrupt politician. <laughs> Good. As you can tell, Silverman isn't exactly in a position to have hired you. You're not part of the organization. Let me explain to you what is really going on here. I am a senator, sent to provide oversight of Silverman's command in the past. He has a tendency to, let me think of the polite term, blatantly ignore orders. Yes, that's the polite way to phrase it. The reality is he tends to shit on congressional oversight and do whatever he pleases. You can see my dilemma. He's a general. It makes him the man. No, it makes him a rogue element. His position is bought and paid for by the taxpayers. My taxpayers. I have to rein him in before he drags us into a war. I'm going to have to ask for your cooperation in this matter. It will make my job much easier. Where's we're ahead, we're liking it or not, man. Yes, if Silverman has his way, but a war isn't what Congress wants. 
the people need this stalemate to go on just a little bit longer. Why can't you call Congress and get your people moving? You clearly don't have the same political mind as we do. There is more at work here than the simple philosophical disagreements between Raiders and NCR. My family is part of a large organization in New Reno with a long history within the NCR. We've seen it through all of its faces, including this decades-long stalemate. We're using it as leverage across a wide theater of influence, the outcome of which is the continued survival of the NCR and our current administrator. Hey. Possibly. Would you like to hear what I'm offering? What? You don't want to know what my lowball offer would be. It involves a stockade and fire ants. Yeah, it won't later. <sighs> Apparently, I just fucked it up because my bartering skill is too low. That's retarded. Anyway. Oh, I thought there was a other person there. Okay. Let's see if I can get out of here without freezing and breaking the game. Nope, out of memory. Well. Sheesh. Okay. Okay. Well, I think that will do it for me, everyone, on New California. Uh, I was going to play the NCR route and stuff, but if it's going to keep crashing every time I go in and out of this place, or I just step into uh, Union City, um, not going to be fun. So, yeah, I think we're done. Uh, I, I can see what that one guy said when I was playing uh, Boulder Dome when he was saying that New California is buggy. Uh, yeah, definitely, definitely buggy. Uh, getting out of memory things when I uh, just walk into stuff. Absolutely crazy. But, uh, yeah. It's a shame. But it did seem like the same things were going to happen. I was going to go to that power plant up north like I did before. And I think the water thing is down near that tribe that's going to tell me that I'm a fucking, like, destroyer or whatever the hell. But, uh, yeah, anyway, I quite enjoyed it until, you know, it started breaking. Uh, some of the writing was a little bit weird and redundant and annoying. Like that stupid tribe that was like, yeah, you're the destroyer and shit. That was just ridiculous. Uh, the ending that I got anyway. The one where I joined the master and became immortal was interesting. But not really cool. I didn't like the fact that I got a really cool gun with only one ammunition for it, and it did not like get used for anything really important other than just shooting the father once. That's all. Um, so that was whatever. I really wanted to use that uh, 88 millimeter more. That would have been just so much fun. So much fun just to, like 88 millimeter people in the face all day, every day. Ugh. I did like when I launched that missile at the bunker. Just now, that was pretty cool. Yeah, good times. So, so next time we stream, I'm not sure what we're going to be doing. Uh, this is all of the fallouts that I have currently uh, that I know of. Yeah. Unless I start playing like Fallout 76 again, uh, which I might do. Uh, this is going to be it for the normal fallouts until Fallout London, Fallout Miami, Fallout Cascadia, Fallout Capital Wasteland, Fallout Vault 13. Um, I think that's all of them. I forget. Fallout 4 Capital Wasteland is the Capital Wasteland, which is Fallout 3 being remade in Fallout 4. And then there's Fallout Vault 13, which is Fallout 1 being made in Fallout 4. And I think someone's also making Fallout 2 in Fallout 4. But I forgot what that one's called. Uh, but yeah, and then there's also, like I said, London, Miami, Cascadia. And they're all full conversion mods that take uh, the, like a, a new map that has nothing to do with the Fallout 
normal story and uh, expand upon. And I think all of those, I know Fallout London and Fallout 4. Fallout Miami might be Fallout New Vegas, I think. No, looking at it, it's Fallout 4 because see the Vault 111 on the back of the uh, picture for it. And Cascadia also looks to be Fallout 4, judging by just the uh, the buildings that are I'm seeing in this screenshot. So when those come out, whether it's, well, it's going to be next year regardless for all of them, I think, uh, simply because uh, London has a definite 2000. A 23 release date not a specific date though which is unfortunate uh, the other ones don't have any information about a release date as usual for these kind of projects it's just whenever they feel like it they come out so yeah i don't know what we're doing next time maybe we'll do fallout 76 maybe we'll do any of the other bunch of games that i have that uh we could play uh I have like a list of ones that I want to play that are all sort of cool, I think. But anyway, everyone, thank you for hanging out, watching and all that. And uh, yeah, I guess uh, until next time, bye for now. Doodles. <laughs>